What is going on YouTube? It is Snake3400. We are back with another Master Duel video for you today. And guess who we are playing with? We are playing with the classic Celtic Guardian. Yes, sir. He's going to be out here guarding all the Celtics, you know, putting in that work. Uh, he is a normal level 4 monster. He ain't really that great. So what we're going to do is we're going to go in with our, uh, basically like our Flame Swordsman build. Kind of make him invincible with our Infernal Noble Knights. And see if we can get some dubs with them. Let's jump into today's video. Oh, whoa, damn. First ever video sponsored with Kieran the Cat. Kieran, say what's up. She likes Yu Gi Oh! too. Alright, so usually we want to go second with this hand, but this is a nice looking hand. Let's go ahead and get our front and open night or gear. Boom, we're gonna use that effect, and we're gonna go ahead and send over. Uh, who do we really need? We don't really need much here, but we're gonna send him into the graveyard. We're gonna use our Heritage of the Chalice. We're gonna keep our Infernal Noble Knight in our hand for later, and you'll know who we're gonna get. <clears throat> oh, I'm trying to find him. Where yet? All right, we're gonna get him to our hand, just so we can summon him to the graveyard. Boop. Very good, we can activate that effect later that can uh, turn the tides of the duel. And we do have a call by the grave in our hand, which is beautiful, but he has no hand traps, it looks like, at least. So, we're gonna get our two tails. Two tails use your effect. We're gonna wanna get a monster to our hand. We don't wanna get none of our Infernal Noble Knights because then we can't put them on the board at all. So, we'll get Obnoxious Cut the Guardian. And you can do either or. I like doing the classic for the sake of the video, but Celtic, uh, you would leave one less card in the graveyard, and you could probably do a better combo. Let's go ahead, boop, 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 send those out, and we're going to get our classic Celtic a Guardian on the board right here, yes sir. Normally we would want to be able to summon our Infernal Noble Knight, but we don't have any Fire Warriors on the board, so that we're going to have to save that for next turn. Let's go ahead and quit. Make our Celtic Guardian invincible real quick. You know what I'm saying? Look at that. Ooh. Only so he's invincible, but he ain't strong. But we don't worry. We can get his strength up next next round, possibly. All right. So we got all that good. We're gonna go ahead and set call by the grave, and we're gonna let our opponent go. Only bad thing about this is we get hit by Harpy's Feather Duster or like a Lightning Storm and we take out back row. It's really bad. <clears throat> but even they do, we could get Rubber Bottles. The good thing is that when these go back into the graveyard, we can still summon our obnoxious Celtic Guardian while we got them to our hand and then re-equip them all to him. Samurai Skull. <laughs> okay, so uh, time skip into that. He just did a whole bunch of stuff and surrendered. So, hey, we got the duel. Let's go on to our next duel. All right, you guys, we got our second duel here. Hopefully, we got a good one. We are going second. Oh, this is um, this is not a bad hand, but it's not a great hand that I would like to start off with. We do run Ash, uh, Max Seas, and Called by the Grays, but it looks like we don't have none of those. But we do have a Pot of Prosperity. So we can do some nice stuff, and we have an expected die. We can do some good stuff with this, depending on what we can draw. <clears throat> oh, look, at he got that diamond icon in this corner. I like that. I need to give me one of them. What? Well, it looks like you guys aren't going to be able to see this hand because he surrendered. So, to another duel. No, we do not need a special summon. Um, what's his name? Well, oh, okay. Why? 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 Well, as you can see, this deck has a 100% win ratio. Alright, you guys, we got our other duel right here. Um, ooh. This is actually a nice looking hand. We are going second. Uh, we do have our Pot of Prosperity too, but we don't really have many hand traps. Hopefully, we can draw into a 
um, what's it get? Call by the Grave, just in case. Oh, oh, disruption. What a good card. Alright, we're gonna let our opponent go, and then we finna go. Alright, you guys, we are going. That is a unique looking card. That's pretty sick right there. Oh, what a good draw. We're going to go ahead and use our Pot of Prosperity. And let me see if I want to banish six or three. Let me check it out. I'll just banish three. I don't really need banish all that much. Actually, I should have banished shit six because there's actually a lot of cards that I don't need in here. <clears throat> oh, well. One, two, three. Three. Ooh, Raigeki. That sounds good. We'll take that. Thank you very much. And we will put him in that. That's not matter. It's not really going to matter too much anyways with orders. So hit him with Raigeki. Spoop boom. Gone. Very good. And now they might rage quit. But we're going to go into our turn. Og. Who are we going to send to the graveyard? We're going to send my dude right here to the graveyard. You wanna know why? Cause we got Infernal Knight, uh, Durin Bolt, and we can equip, and we're gonna search out Oliver. We could probably get full combo here if you don't rage. So, Oliver, get to our hand. Then we're gonna go ahead and special summon Oliver. Uh, by discarding him. Now we got all those cards in the graveyard we need. Actually, I should have got um, a different card here, but that's okay. We're gonna go into our two tails. We're gonna have to probably do a play with Obnoxious because we have a regular Celtic Guardian in our hand already. So, we'll get him. Oh, that's right. Oh, that is gonna be sick. Okay. We'll use effect. I'm gonna go ahead and send four to the graveyard. We'll send those four and then we're gonna go ahead and special summon our Obnoxious. And then we're gonna go ahead and use our effect for our noble knight. We're gonna banish himself from the graveyard. Hmm, beautiful. And then now you know what we can do? Oh, we cannot summon him this turn. Oh, shoot. Okay, well, I kind of messed up on that. Anyways, uh, we'll go into our three rank, or should we keep it as is? I'll go into our three rank. He's a good card to have out just in case, you never know, especially during battle phase. Let's get our uh, Noxious equipped real quick. Can't be destroyed by battle already, so what we're going to do is just equip the two on him. And yeah. We're gonna banish him so he could use his effect as a backup plan. You never know what can happen. Let's go in our battle phase. Exactly why we got our triple burst, and our triple burst did not uh, do what I thought it does. Okay, well. Uh, when the spell trap or effect monster is activated, quick <laughs> wait. During the damage step? Was that not during damage step? I'm so confused. Oh well. We'll go ahead and let our opponent go. Negates the attack. Makes sense. He's leaking. Oh, he is going to the sun. Very good. Alright, we... Oh, we got a good draw here, you guys. Beautiful, because now we can get the card that we need. Put that onto him, and then break it off. Oh, we're gonna need to normal summon a card here. Well, why not normal summon or gear off? Because it has a good effect. Oh, effect that. We're gonna go ahead and send a. Um, we don't really need much here. We'll go ahead and send Oliver probably. Why not? And then we can special summon him. Oh, it's not a normal monster. I had an idea in hand, but it's okay. What we're gonna do is we're gonna get R. 
Mage power. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And we'll go ahead and equip him to him. He can already not be destroyed by battle, so that don't really matter too much. Actually, ah, oh, there is something. I got an idea. I messed up, so we'll put that on him. We're going to redo that. We're going to go ahead. Boop. And boop. That's what we want. Get our Inferno Noble Knight Captain Oliver. Uh, yes, we'll use that effect. We're gonna want that, that, and that to our hand, or back into our deck, and we can draw a card. Beautiful combo. Oh, yes, sir, yes, sir. So we're gonna attach our. Oh, he's not in there anymore. Okay, well, we'll just attach. Can't be equipped, cannot be destroyed. Which one do we want? Guess we're gonna go ahead and use that effect and destroy. Beautiful. And we get that free 2,000 damage on him like that. Look at it. Beautiful. Celtic Guardian, get in with the big hit. Let's go. We're going to pass, and our opponent is going to have one card in his hand. Let's see what he can do with it. Ooh, Sun Dragon activates his own effect. Oh, very nice. Okay, brings that out. Smart. But this is why we have the other card that we activated in the great, I mean the banish. Let's go. Uh, we're going to go ahead and summon. Yes, sir. We're going to special summon. We're going to special summon him back. Yes, sir. Woohoo. Special summon our Infernal Noble Knight. We're going crazy. We're going in. That's why this deck is good with the rebuttals. And it's hard to take out your obnoxious, and then if you have that lined up, all the more better. Uh, we're gonna... Oh, I don't have that in my graveyard, actually. Uh, we'll just get Power of the Guardian. That's fine. Okay. And... You know what? We didn't even normal summon yet. Why not get Celtic Guardian out here? Why not get Celtic Guardian out here? Like, why not? Just why not? Uh-huh, uh-huh. Yep. Activate. Get rid of that. Thank you. We're gonna go in. We about to go in. Put that in our other Celtic Guardian so he can't be destroyed at least once per turn. And we're going crazy. Attack. Psych. We activate our effect first. Get blown up. Boom. Go crazy. Oh, he's still getting life points? Oh. Brought himself back. Continue to attack. Not only once. Ah, I'll so back and do it again. Oh well. Noxious. Boom. I was gonna say, don't tell me they just keep coming back. I can't do much with that. And regular Celtic, let's go. Build up your attack, baby. Look at that board right there. Let's go. Celtic Guardian. Noxious Celtic Guardian. Uh, we don't have Noble Arms because uh, I don't really like running the Noble Arms Celtic Guardian because you have to have no cards in your hand, which would work now, but I don't know. These two is all we need. Oh, okay. He sets one, so we can, can't be destroyed by battle. That's why we put that on him. Already know. Already know. You're done. You're done. He's going to gain some life points, but actually, nah, you're done. Straight to battle phase. 
destroy this guy. And we're going to use the effect to destroy the other dude. You don't get nothing back. Double destroy. That's okay. Continue to attack. Yes, sir. Ooh, Sangan. What's he going to get? He might get some. Okay. Alright, cool, cool. That's alright, that's alright. Obnoxious. Let's go ahead for the win with the classic Celtic Guardian attack! Ah! Yes! Let's go, baby! Alright, you guys, we got the deck profile right here for you. So, we are running. We only need the one Celtic Guardian, and we only won run one Obnoxious Celtic Guardian. That's all you need, because we search them a lot. What we want to run is mostly Infernal Noble Knights. All right, run three, uh, two of this guy. I'm gonna let you look at it, uh, and you can, you know, you can take the cards if you're playing it, add to it, take, you know, however you want to edit it. Y'all know what y'all know what I'm talking about. Got two Ash Blossoms, two Maxis. We are wanting to go second. Uh, definitely want to run those. You could put a Nib in here. I'm not really worried about Nib, um, because. If you draw a nib in your first turn, it's really not going to be a good draw, and you might break a lot from that. And Regeki, Harpy's Feather Duster, a Lightning Storm, all really good cards to wipe the board. You want to go second. Monster Reborn, uh, you got to search your warriors. Instant Fusion, as you saw, could be good in certain situations. Beautiful thing about Instant Fusion still is that you can use your Relinquish and take over a monster, and then use that, and you can uh, link into something else, and you get to take up on this monster. Or just go into Time Wizard of Tomorrow because if you get everything for your Celtic Guardian, he can't be destroyed if you use Time Wizard's ability and you destroy everything on the board. Crazy, crazy move there. Unexpected die, uh, you can get Celtic Guardian out early and then, you know, do bigger plays, I would say. Uh, just searches for Infernal. Uh, and then we got a couple equip cards, more searches. And then we got Draco back, which is good situations. Put on your normal Celtic, you can target people's cards and put it back in the hand just demolish their board with that extra deck go ahead and take a look right here we got some stuff we got some stuff and yeah that's about it right there all right you guys that's the end of today's video i hope you liked it uh this deck was really fun and uh, it's really cool that i get to play with celtic guardian and make them like a boss card where people are trying to struggle with look with with this dude right here classic celtic guardian struggling with them oh man and it's like so nostalgic just seeing them on the board really fun deck to play with uh if you guys have any suggestions just leave a uh, comment below i'll go ahead and check those out uh appreciate all of y'all watching and still coming to my channel and i just want to thank all of you guys for coming out and watching today's video uh i really appreciate you know you guys to support all the subscribers uh we're still bidding up we got past the 100 milestones so trying to see if we can get up to 200 uh if you like this video and other contents that I be posting leave a like comment and subscribe i love reading you guys' comments uh, building the community and you know just trying to build my channel i've been working on it new intros new outros but uh, until next time i'll see you guys on the next one